Hello, Wasco executives, and welcome to this wonderful, happiness, pony-filled game of rainbows and sunshine. Ignore the creepy statue and the random blurbs of Get Out While You Can in the background. Um, and the, the blood. <laughs> And the just overall eeriness of this title screen. Um, yeah, I'm going to play this for your amusement, and you're going to watch me uh, enjoy the ponies and sunshine, and yeah, if you haven't noticed, I'm lying about the happiness and ponies and sunshine. So, yeah, let's just get right to it, shall we? Um, this... For those of you who do not know, this is a game where, well, you'll see. I They give you a little bit of calm at the very beginning in order to explain things, I guess. Um, but Ziggler, um, just to make this interesting, I'm going to do this on Keter mode, or is it pronounced Keter? 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 You know what, screw that, Euclid. Actually, no, Keter. I, I don't want to have to do this any more than I have to. And... Let's just say this thing... This thing is bad news. Let's just say that. Um... Map Seed. I don't wanna die. <laughs> All caps. I don't wanna die. <laughs> I hate myself for making me play this, but hey, it's some the things I won't do for internet fame, you know? Uh, <laughs> well, let's get started, shall we? SCP-895. SCP-895 is an ornate causes disruptions in video photographic surveillance equipment and within 50 meters of more to vivid, disturbing hallucinations with variable duration and regular corresponding to the camera's proximity to the SCP. I actually also, before deciding to play this, wrote a fan fiction on it. Um, I don't know why. I just kind of did called um same website. If you search up the term. Eminent Breach of Containment. I might put a link to it in the description this time. I probably should have done that with the other one. Within range of 5 meters of SCP, footage capture can cause severe psychological trauma and hysteria in those subjects. Lovely. Okay. Well, anyways. Um. Oh, that was a lovely noise to tell you when the game was done loading. And here we are. Okay. So first things first, um, let's read this lovely piece of paper. Okay. Orientation leaflet for the Class D personnel. On behalf of the SCP Foundation, our staff, we welcome you to the exciting one level I've got some period. work for you. Please step out of the cell. Jesus, man, I'm reading! Seriously. <sighs> Fine. Jess, follow me. We're authorized to kill any disobedient test subjects, so don't try anything stupid. So what if I go this way? Would they... Would they kill me if I went that way? I have no idea. I just know that the guards will actually kill you if you don't do as they say. Um... Let it also be known that I'm playing this in broad daylight once again. Or as broad daylight as I can get, considering it's cloudy as hell outside. Um, yeah, and I'm playing this first thing in the morning, so if I sound really tired or unenthusiastic about anything, well, I don't know, whatever. Aha, and here we are! SCP-173! Follow the instructions from the intercom, and you'll probably be fine. Probably be fine? Who's the person on the intercom, GLaDOS? I will laugh when that is true. 
Game developer of this game. Make the intercom guy GLaDOS. <laughs> Anyways, I gotta sneeze real quick. Don't shoot me! I'm sneezing! <sighs> or not. I don't know. Secure, contain, protect. Okay. Hey, bros, what up? Why? <laughs> uh huh. Attention, all Class D personnel. Please enter the containment chamber. I don't want to! There's death in there! Fine, I'll go. What's the worst that can happen, you know? Please approach SCP Behold! For testing. The face of evil! Uh, there's I'm leaving. To be a problem I'm leaving. With the door control I know how this ends! No responding to any of our attempts to close it, so. Please maintain direct eye contact with SCP-173 and- I know how this ends! Oh my! Guy's running! Smart idea, guy! Oh god, where is it, 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 where is it? Ah! And the power goes out. That's just... Well, that was the containment breach part of the game. I'm just gonna get this gas mask and uh, what was that noise? That was a scary noise. I'm just gonna read this paper. Nothing come up behind me while I'm reading it. Okay, so here is the SCP document depicting what this thing is. Um <sighs> You can very easily just pause it, but actually I'm going to read the important parts of it. Basically, it is supposed to be locked in that container. It is constructed from concrete and rebar with traces of Krylon brand spray paint, uh, which would explain the colors on it. Um, it is, in fact, unkillable because of this fact. And the object cannot move within a direct line of sight. Direct line of sight must not be broken at any time with SCP-173. So yeah. Basically, if you blink while this thing is in front of you, it will kill you. And there are other SCPs. Uh, oh my! I think I saw him behind that door. Okay, so the volt, the nine volt batteries that you're, I picked up, or the nine volt battery that I picked up, is useful for when you get um, like nav trackers and radios and stuff like that. Um, because a radio is actually very important later in the game, uh, because it lets you actually talk to one of the SCPs that will help you escape. I know this, and yet I've never gotten this far in the game. Did the door open? No, it didn't. Okay. I, I don't really want to continue, but you know, because this game is like scary as hell. Just watch. Um, well, let me uh, brush, while I'm still on my nerves, um, let me tell you about the other SCPs. There is the old, the sculpture, which we just saw murder brutally about three people. Um, and probably a few others, because I heard some gunshots. Um, then there is the old man, which the old man will come out of a wall or a floor. And if you don't look at him or you stay a good enough distance away from him, he will just disappear back into the wall and, you know, nothing will happen. But if you get too close or you look at him, he will come out of the wall all the way and start following you at a walking pace. He doesn't chase you. It's just at a walking pace. And that's about it. Then there is really... Then there is the coffin which we saw before, which we actually had to go into the test chamber with that thing, and if we do look at it, we will die of a heart attack. Um, what was that noise? Please
please tell me those are guns. I'd, I'd prefer the feeling of somebody shooting at me than having to be in the same room as that thing. Anyways, back to explaining. Basically, uh, where was I? Then I believe there's also the Hard to Destroy Reptile, which actually is SCP, I forget the number. Um, and basically, what this thing does, this reptile, is like super big, and you only catch a glimpse of it at the very end of the game, where it basically uses its toenail to swat down a helicopter. Well, it may not use its toenail, it may just use its arm, but I mean, it may use its whole arm, but you know, you get the point, it's huge, it's like Godzilla. You got Godzilla locked up in this joint. And then, throughout the game, you'll find a couple joke at SCPs, which is the Potty Monster and 420J, which, um, J, I think most of you know what that stands for. Um, I'm just gonna slowly open this door. Okay, I'm going to put on my gas mask. Just in case. I'm very scared. Okay, nothing's in there, because, you know, it's actually proven that if you blink once at the entrance to a room, and nothing comes after you, that basically means there's nothing in there. Which means I should be safe in doing... Ah! Okay. Should have probably closed that door. Took off the gas mask. No dim. Okay. Um... Yeah, eventually you we will catch a glimpse of the old man as he runs across a hallway through two portals. Um, but until then, we just have a sculpture to worry about, which... HOLY FUCKING SHIT! What was that? Um... What was that? What was that? Okay, um... <laughs> Yeah, um, yeah, I think I'm not going to be able to play this game anymore, uh, it already has my, it already has my hands shaking, just, no, I'm, I'm not doing this, fuck internet fame, I just want to keep my pants clean, okay? Ooh, I heard the statue moving! 